Hello. It is Friday the 11th of May and today I'm going home. I'll be leaving Southampton Hospital, uh, closing this chapter of the journey and beginning the next one at home. So in a few hours I'll be back in my own home with my little doggy and uh, it's going to be good. So I've just had a um, <clears throat> a pentamidine nebulizer which is uh, similar to the nebulizer I had before. It's like a tube and there's some liquid and uh, it turns it into vapor, you breathe it in and it's supposed to protect me from things like I think it was pneumonia and flu and similar sort of um, infections so I have to have that four times a week so I'll be booking another one in four weeks time uh, I do believe I have a photo of it here there we go So that's what it looked like. Um, it's not very pleasant, it dries your mouth out a bit and uh, some people can feel a bit nauseous from it but I wasn't too bad. <clears throat> I think the trick is just keep swallowing and that way you, uh, your mouth doesn't dry out in the back of your throat. It has given me a little bit of a cough but that is uh, quite common. So we're just waiting now for my lift to arrive that being my parents, we'll uh, pack up everything, clothes, xbox, any food that's left in the fridge and then we'll get all the, uh, the drugs that I'll be needing for the next however long, get the drug chart and uh, away we go. Put quite a bit of thought into what I want to do when I get home things on the top of my list are go to the cinema watch Avengers Infinity War because I don't know how much longer I can keep away from spoilers they seem to be everywhere next would be just food in general uh, preferably spicy chicken maybe fajitas or Frank's hot wings from Domino's maybe some Nando's I think I'm ready to push it up to extra hot sauce with the Nando's. That's all I've been craving really is just spicy chicken. Maybe a barbecue as well. Of course making sure that everything is cooked properly. Sticking to the neutropenic diet of course. So, Avengers, food, wanna walk my dog. I wanna walk Max. Be good just to get outside, get the legs working, enjoy some fresh air and I'm actually not allowed to uh, pick up his waist as well that's, uh, that's part of my wellness regime I wouldn't be really able to walk him by myself because I'm not supposed to pick up his poop not complaining I'll tell you what another pretty handy thing is going home today is the Wi-Fi in the hospital like went down yesterday and we have our own little Wi-Fi gizmo as well just because the hospital Wi-Fi is a bit slow uh, and that just ran out yesterday as well so all I had was the data on my phone to last me the day and it doesn't look like the hospital Wi-Fi is fixed yet so I don't know how much longer I would have lasted in here
good condition. <laughs> Hello, hi Maxi. What's that? What's that? Hello. Hello, buddy. Hello. He's back. Hey guys. Who is it? He looks so fluffy. Hello. Hello. Hello, Maxi. Oh, did you miss me? Don't let him lick your face. <laughs> Come on, Come on then. You're home. Yes, I am. And it feels great. First thing I did was took a tour of the house, see what's changed. Not a lot, really. Um, and then I set up my Xbox straight away. I hadn't really played much Xbox while I was in Southampton. The Wi-Fi just uh, didn't cut it. And then, Mum made homemade Nando's with wedges. And it was phenomenal. Probably the best meal I've had in the last month, really. So I'm just going to uh, enjoy my first night back home in my own bed. I will engage the starfish maneuver. It's gonna be good. Well, I will. Uh, I will get right on that. There will be more videos coming from home regarding uh, future treatments and things like that. So. I'll be going to Southampton now every Monday and Thursday for checkups and things. Um, and there's a lot of drugs I have to take still. But at least I'm home. That's the main thing. Right. Thank you for watching today's video. It's been a good day. See you later.